everybody, damn it! My own home is starting to feel as isolated as the cottage on Mystic Island. Well, get a grip, Alan. Because you will soon be rid of both of them. Who needs a wife who cheats and a son who can't keep his own hands off of his stepmother? Hell, both of them. Maybe Alexander was right. I need to take one of... Now. Now I'm fine. I'm calm. Who needs these? Home sweet home. This is not my home. Well, it's better than the alternative. Yes. Yes. Right. I'm going to check with Nolan, make certain that your room is ready. Thank you. Where is that damn lipstick? You're going to be in the room right next to mine. Oh, you know, I, I, I am grateful that you got me out of jail and everything, but I don't think it's wise that we have slumber parties just yet. <laughs> don't worry, Olivia. Fat chance you and I will become best friends, my dear. I just want you to be in a room far enough away from Alan and still be in the house. Then what the hell is she doing in this house? Could you bring her back to this house, What's Alexander? What's the matter, Alan? You afraid to talk to me directly? All right, Alan, I want you to calm down. Now, are you sure you didn't, don't need to take one of the... I don't need a pill. I need her out of this house. I thought th that you were locked up. Oh, well, it looks like things don't always go the way you plan, eh, Alan? Uh, why don't you ask your sister here why I'm here? Well? She's pregnant, Alan. Uh, all right, it was one of the conditions of her bail. You posted a bail, Alexandra? Uh, what? Uh, Alan, if you were thinking at all straight, you would have done exactly the same thing. I mean, someone's got to take care of this child. Yes, obviously Olivia's not up to the task. Hey, you know what? I can go and go ten rounds with you if you'd like. I have to be in this house with you for the time being. Other than that, we have nothing in common. Nothing in common. That's my baby that you happen to be carrying. Maybe not. That's enough, Olivia. You shouldn't get upset. You know what? I think it's time we got all of this out in the open. Get what out in the open? I slept with Philip just after you switched my birth control pills. Philip could be this baby's father. You're lying, Olivia. Just like you lied to me about our baby being no, dead. No, Alan, it's true. Philip and I made love before the divorce, yes, but after you played Russian roulette with my birth enough, control enough, pills. Enough, 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 enough. Listen, this can't be that much of a shock to you, Alan. Surely you've considered the possibility. Oh, because... I know that she wanted to punish me. Philip wants to punish me. He will do anything to hurt me. But no, I don't think this happened. He wouldn't cross that line, and neither would you. It was it a about you. Philip told me that he loved me and I love him. That's why we made love. Olivia, you are my wife. We pledged our oh, love to each other. Don't even with... talk to me about pledges and love and vows. Those are things you know nothing about. And you do? He's my son. How could you? Oh, you know what's wrong. It was all wrong. It was wrong to marry you in the first place knowing I had feelings for him. But you had heart attacks, two of them, and I bought it. And then you decided that we were going to have a family. And you got me pregnant against my will. Everything I did, I did for you, for us. Now, perhaps it wasn't always honorable, but you're pregnant and you want that child. So everything I did was hey. right. Hey, what the hell is going on? He knows. All right. He knows well, about us because I told him. I told him everything. I want you all to stop this right now. Your father shouldn't be agitated. Neither should Olivia. <laughs> Philip, always the protector. And I will protect her <laughs> and the child that she's carrying. Against me? If necessary. You know, 
You are a pathetic excuse for a son, Philip. You see what your revenge against me has cost us? No, it wasn't about you. Of course it was about me. But the only thing that you two have in common is your hate against me. All right, come on, that's enough. Yeah, come in, come out here. Come out here. For... It was time. It was time he knew the truth about everything. Are you okay? I'm fine. Just made him angrier than ever. So if he didn't already have enough reason to frame me. Don't worry about that right now. Don't worry about anything right now, because I promise you, I'll take care of everything. Yeah, well, um, thanks for standing up for me. Well, we're in this together. Hey. I know how stressful and uh, how crazy and confusing these last few months have been for you. And I listen, I know what it's like to want to take revenge, you know, to go after something with, with a, such a fury that you, that you start to lose yourself a little bit. I know what that's like. I'm not gonna go after Alan. I told you I'm done with him. You have to worry. That's not what I'm talking about. Then what? Don't say anything yet. I know that this is the color that was used to write on the wall at Rivas, and I know it's a shade that you said you've never used. I know that you lied to me because you felt like you had to, because you were afraid. What I'm telling you is that you don't have to be afraid because I will stand by you and I will help you. You think I'm Reva Stalker? I don't know what to think. No, you're the one who's lying. Olivia, I just want to help you. There's something you can do for me. Tell me. You can go to hell. Olivia. No, I lied. I lied about the lipstick, okay? I don't know why I did it. Maybe it was an impulse. They have so many strikes against me already, but that doesn't mean that I'm the stalker. Hey. I have been on your side all the way through this. Until I lied to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I have a history of people not believing me even when I tell the truth. I fell back on my instincts. I felt like my back was up against the wall, okay? But I guess I wasn't completely wrong because here you are ready to lock me up and throw oh, hey, away wait, the no, key. Lock, I don't want you locked up. No, I want you out here. Because of the baby, I know. No. That's only one reason. Look, I just... I thought you were, the, you were the one person in this town who wasn't against me. I'm not against Why you. I'm I on your side. Why on Reva now? Isn't that taking a woman's scorn to all new levels? Oh. But I guess I have it coming, considering all the stupid things I've done. I messed a lot of things up. And I know I've ruined any chance that we might have together. But the one thing I didn't want to lose in all of this was the belief that you know me. I didn't do the things that I'm accused of, Philip. I'm not Reva Stalker. When you told me that you loved me, it, just, it felt like it was the first time anyone has ever said that to me. And I just, I thought to myself, this is the way it's supposed to be. You know, this is what people talk about and this is what they die to have. And I know that that's changed. I, I know, I know I messed things up. I just, you said that you could see me, that you could see into me. And as frightening as that is for me, you can. So you have to know that I didn't do this. I have the whole world stacked up against me right now, Philip. And I can handle other people, you know, I, I can, I can take them, but I, I can't handle fighting you right now. Okay. I'm 
I'm sorry. I believe you. I'm going to prove that I'm innocent. All right. How? I'm going to find the person who's guilty. And I think I know who that is. Your father. <laughs> <laughs>